Hello, Ducks fans. I'm Michael Pollock. I'm here with outfielder Lou Ford, who is back for the 2014 season. He will also serve as the team's hitting coach. Lou, welcome back here to Long Island. How excited are you to get underway here in 2014? Well, I'm, I'm very excited. Uh, you know, we're coming off of back-to-back uh, -back championships, and, uh, you know, we're, we're looking forward to seeing the new guys and having the guys return and, uh, you know, getting back on the road to to hopefully win a, a third one here. So it's, it's very exciting to be back here. Well, Lou, you had the opportunity to win the championship here with the Long Island Ducks last season. What was that experience like for you after you were listening to the 2012 championship from a major league clubhouse? Oh, well, you know, I haven't I haven't ever done that here. And, I, you know, that was my fourth year here. And, you know, it's always something you're working toward. And, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a great feeling accomplishing those goals with, you know your your friends and teammates and uh, the fans and and you know it was it was just great you know and uh, I think everybody uh, feels like this next year you know we we're gonna try to do it again because uh, I don't know we we've really uh, we really come together last year I guess uh, last season when you came to Long Island you had a hit in all but one game including the playoffs what was clicking for you so well at the plate down that playoff run last season uh oh I. I I don't know if anything was necessarily clicking. Just, uh, uh, I think being a leadoff hitter, I took maybe a little different approach and uh, didn't try to necessarily hit a lot of home runs, but you know, try to get on base for the other guys and uh, you know, have some confidence in the guys behind me to, you know, knock me in, and uh, you know, it, it ended up working out really well for us. 2012 specifically was such a whirlwind year for you. You start with the Ducks, have a great first month, and then it's off to the Baltimore Orioles organization, and by July you're in the major leagues. What was that experience like for you, and how crazy of a year was it for you to go from the Atlantic League to the major leagues? I, you know, it's it's even, it's kind of hard to put into words. Uh, that year was just uh, amazing, you know, and, you know, something I'll never forget, and I've, I've you know, I started here in Long Island and got the chance coming out of here, and I think that's something that, you know, I could share with other guys coming in that, uh, and also guys that play in this league that, uh, you know, the, the Atlantic League is a great league. You know, you, you're still following your dreams, and, uh, you know, there, there's a chance. You know, there's a chance to attain those. You know, it happens, and, you know, I'm not the only person it's happened for. So, you know, I, you know, I've, I have a lot of... Uh, you know, respect for Long Island Ducks and the Atlantic League, you know, for helping me get back and reach my reach my goals. And now you're going to be the hitting coach for this Ducks team in 2014. Tell me how that came about, what the decision was for you to become the hitting coach, and what kind of experience and other information do you feel you can pass on to the other members of this Ducks roster? Well, you know, it's, it is my first year, and I'm, uh, you know, I'm planning on, you know, picking uh, KB's brain and Fuki and, uh, you know, just – you know, I'm here to learn too, you know, and, you know, I'm going to share with the guys what I know and, you know, about hitting, you know, the mental side of it and, uh, you know, be there if they need anything, you know, just try to keep an open door and, uh, you know, it's going to be a learning experience and I'm really excited about it because it's something, you know, I want to uh, pursue in the future for my career. So, you know, I'm really excited about this year. And you talk about manager Kevin Bias and pitching coach Steve Foucault, two guys who you played under the last two seasons. Uh, how much did you enjoy playing under both of them, and how excited are you to join their staff here in 2014? Yeah, KB's been here, you know, every year for me, and uh, Fuki I've known for a couple of years. So, uh, you know, great guys. I respect them a lot, and I'm I'm excited to work with them. You know, KB has played done the same role as a uh, player coach before, so I, you know I. I I plan on uh, really lean on him on, uh, you know, how to manage my time and, uh, you know, kind of balance everything out. And, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's exciting for me, really. And, uh, you know, seeing, seeing the other guys on the team that are coming in, you know, it, it even makes it more exciting because I know there's going to be, we're going to have a good team. You know, it's, it's going to be a good team to work with and, and a good team to coach, good group of guys. And finally, Lou, what's your message to the Ducks fans here as we get ready for the 2014 season? Come on out and see us. It's going to be exciting. You know, we're going to have a good team this year. You know, we got back-to-back -back championships, and, uh, uh, you know, we're, we're going for three. We got, you know, so come on out and come on out and watch some games. Well, Ducks fans, that is Lou Ford, outfielder and hitting coach for the 2014 season, back for his fifth year here with the Long Island Ducks. Lou, great to have you back, and we look forward to a great 2014 season. Thanks, Mike.